That's right. But we get to play a little Santa here, and I know a lot of people are still doing a little gift shopping over the holidays here, and we have a few fun toys for the, uh, for the tech geek in your life. And um, at the end of the show, we're actually going to give some of these toys away uh, in a drawing for some of the registered uh, viewers of this show. The online audience. The thanks. online audience, okay. yes. Sorry for the studio audience, but uh, they have alcohol. So, um, uh, David, what do, what do we have here? Okay, well, the first thing we're going to show off are uh, DB's Logic, DB Logic's uh, in-ear headphones. And what we have here is a, a package that's showing the uh, blue version, but just like a lot of in-ear headphones, you also have a lot of different colors. So why are we giving these away? What makes these special? Well, they come in this little case. That's not very special. Here are the, uh, the red versions. What's special about these is they have a special technology on them that prevents your ears from being damaged in the event that you play your music or your audio too loud from your MP3 player, your iPod, or your iPad. Like so, your uh, Barry Manilow Christmas selection? That's right, my Barry Manilow uh, Christmas selection. You know, uh, these are great for the geek who likes to play really loud music in their ears, but it's also great for kids. I mean, I think about my kids who listen to DVDs, you can't tell how loud the audio is in your ears. This will prevent the uh, damage from happening to your eardrums. Okay, we are also going to give away some games from Gameloft, some phone games. Some of these are on um, the iPhone or iOS and some on, on Android. First, we have Modern Combat 3, um, Fallen Nations. This is on iOS. Um, this is, uh, uh, Fallen Nation is an immersive experience in this apocalyptic scenario. I have played this game and it's, you know, great for holidays. You shoot everybody up and you kill them. It's awesome. Um, uh, the next game is Nova 2. This is more of a sci-fi shoot 'em up game. This is on iOS and Android, um, and I know a lot of people are familiar with that game as well. And finally, we have Asphalt 6 Adrenaline. This is the uh, car racing game. Um, I'm really, really bad at these games, but this is also for iOS and Android. Um, what's this uh, fun little thing you have there? Yeah, so thanks for uh, asking because um, this is for the green geek in your life. This is uh, from SolarJuice.com. It's called the Juice Orange, and it's uh, as as a probably as you probably guessed by now, it's a solar charger for your devices, and uh, it will work with just about any device. What makes it cool is that it comes with this little baggie full of different connectors for everything from uh, cell phones to even a 30-pin connector for iPads, iPods, and so on. So it'll charge just about anything up. Uh, uh, solar Juice claims that uh, one hour of sunlight is the equivalent of two hours of talk time. And uh, you got this handy dandy hole here in case you want to lock it up. That's what they say the hole is for, to lock it down to some location. And then on the back, you've got uh, these little legs that pop out so you can angle it in any direction towards the sun. That's Solar Juice. That's J O O S, not J U I C E. All right, and this right here, you will love this. This is uh, called the Luxie Camera. And um, this little camera actually has got a, a, an earpiece right here so you can put around your ear. And it talks Bluetooth to your phone, your iPhone or your Android phone. And then it streams the video out onto the internet to select people in your address book. So speaking of cloud, we just had the whole conversation about the cloud. This is all in the cloud. That's right. And what I like about it is you can put it in this little clip here and you can put it on your, well I can put it on my Santa hat, but you can put it on your bike helmet. Um, there are clips for caps and you can take these things out um, to your kid's soccer game and stream them back. So does that mean I can put this on top of my head, start taping you and get rid of all these Yeah, we can get rid of all, right the, all the equipment we have here yeah, okay. and then it, we can even do special things like put this fisheye lens on there, it's magnetic and it snaps on it just like that. So uh, cool little technology yeah, from Luxie. Talk about the cloud eliminating a lot of jobs right away, okay. So the next thing I want to show off is uh, Harmony Link from Logitech. Now what Harmony Link does is um, if you've ever tried to kind of use one of those universal remote controls and had a hard time using it, if you're an iPad user, maybe you can turn your iPad into a remote control. Well, this is the thing that does the trick. This is basically an infrared broadcaster. It'll work with all of your different uh, um, infrared based devices, your big flat screens, your audio system and so on and so forth and it integrates with your iPad. There's an app for that and in the app you can actually pick your favorite TV shows or whatever it may be and, um, and it'll automatically turn on whatever devices are necessary to play the content you want. So that's the Harmony Link from Logitech. All right, we've got only a couple minutes here left, so I want to get through this quickly. This is also from Logitech. It's a mini boom box, and it works over Bluetooth. We'll see a lot of these coming out now, and um, we'll see a lot more at CES. I just like the size of this. It's quite nice. You get up to 30 feet of 
distance here. You can also use it as a speaker phone. So that's from Logitech, the uh, mini boom box. Can you hold it up here and get the same prestige you used to get in the 80s? Like that's right, remember? just like you did. Okay, right, all right. The next thing we have here is the Kindle Nook. This is sort of a stand-in. It's not are, a Kindle. Uh, I'm sorry, Kindle Nook. Is it Mindshare is everything. So what we have here is from Barnes & Noble, the Nook, which is, uh, this is the black and white version. We're actually going to be giving away the color version. And, uh, and you know, what's remarkable about this device is it's a lot smaller than your typical um, e-reader. So it's uh, a lot more portable maybe, maybe fits in places that the Kindle from Amazon and uh, other devices like the iPad can't fit. Um, they say more battery power, There's, it's a lot faster. They say uh, uh, two processors in here, a lot of different colors. You can get all of the magazine, uh, newspaper, and book content that's available on barnesandnoble.com plus your email. So uh, we're giving away a Nook. All right, this next thing is one of my favorites. I love this product. Um, it's called the Zio Sleep Manager, and um, I actually have it around my head here. And uh, You need a Santa hat too, though, right? Yeah, that's right, you have to have the Santa hat. But it's, it's, there are a lot of technologies that monitor your sleep, and they, they allow you to, uh, uh, they, they measure your body temperature, your activity, and that's how they do it. This actually has some special technology in it that uh, measures your brain waves, and it knows when you're sleeping, and then it connects to this uh, nifty little uh, phone app and uh, over Bluetooth, and then you wake up in the morning. These are my scores, my ZQ, my Zio sleep scores. Some of these are pretty good, 58, not so good there. But it shows you how much REM sleep, how much deep sleep, uh, and how much light sleep that you're getting. And it also helps you manage uh, the sleep that you get and, and understand what activities you have during the day that might affect that sleep. And then you kind of dock it into this. Uh, into this little thing right here and charge it up overnight. How secure is the Bluetooth link? Like if I hack it, can I read your brain waves and figure out what secrets you're hiding in there? You can actually plant your own dreams in my head, which oh, is uh, just a scary thought. Kind of like Inception and yeah. Dreamscape, right? What's our last thing here? This looks like a Blackberry playbook. It, it, it sure does look like a Blackberry playbook, but that's not what it is. It is, in fact, the, uh, the Kindle Fire, which right now is on fire. We're talking about this is the uh, second hottest selling tablet on the market after the iPad. And what we've got here is uh, the new Fire, of course, $199 if you're going to buy one. But as you know, Amazon is uh, heavily subsidizing the cost of this. So it's clearly uh, one of the reasons it's number two in the market is that that subsidization has brought the price down way below that of an iPad. One of the great things you can do with this particular device is you can get, uh, compared to previous Kindles, you can get all the movie content and also audio content that's available from Amazon and load it right onto the device. Whoops, we have a, it's a little quirky here because we don't have it assigned to an account. But a uh, great gift, the product is definitely on fire on the market and we're going to give one of these away to one of our lucky viewers.